Emily Blunt met Christopher Nolan for the Dark Knight trilogy, winning the Best Girl Wins. Function Emily Blunt almost played the lead role in the Dark Knight trilogy, the actress disclosed recently. Emily Blunt disclosed in an interview with Happy Sad Confused Podcast that she initially approached director Christopher Nolan about a part in his DC films. After playing J. Robert Oppenheimer's wife Kitty in Christopher Nolan's most recent film, Oppenheimer, Blunt stated she hopes to collaborate with him once more. According to the actress, she met him very briefly while filming the Batman movies. Very briefly, I met him, Blunt answered but I don't think I was right. Josh Horowitz continued by inquiring about the role for which she had met with him and if it was for Catwoman, who ultimately went to Anne Hathaway, her co-star in The Devil Wears Prada. No, I think it was before that, the speaker said, indicating that Rachel Dawes was involved. Katie Holmes originated the role in Batman Begins in 2005, and Maggie Gyllenhaal took it over in The Dark Knight. Although she didn't say specifically which movie it was for, internet gossip suggested it was for The Dark Knight. Blunt continued, Listen, the best girl wins. Regarding collaborating with Nolan once more, Blunt disclosed that she is unsure of the role she would like to take on in his movies. I'm not sure. I mean, I have this feeling that he's going to come up with some insanely brilliant idea that will surpass anything I can think of. I just hope he gives me a call. As a result of Emily Blunt and Christopher Nolan's work on Oppenheimer, Blunt was nominated for an Academy Award in the Best Supporting Actress category. Her first Oscar nomination, which would result in her first win, is for the role of Kitty Oppenheimer.